Hey, how you doing guys? This is Little Powerhouse 102. How you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing all right. Yeah, guys, um, I just wanted to share a little custom He-Man that I did. And uh, so you guys can see a little bit more in detail how he looks. Um, I do want to use them for my storytelling um, activities that I have going on with the Origins. And um, yeah, guys, I just wanted to share with you guys the detail on this uh, on this uh, custom here. See, so we could uh, put the camera a little bit more towards him. So here we have a um, a He-Man head with uh, with the with the flying hair or the hair in the wind. There he has a lot of weapons. He got the sword, his axe. His, um, his shield and he has a hammer here with his with his crest right there um, as you can see on his armor he has um vintage elements there on the side of his armor with the with the red straps there and um, on his armor here he has um the vintage crest just so you guys make sure that he is he-man I love all the colors, his boot colors, um, just just really cool. I think he, this this figure is the the Casey Jones figure. Um, when I saw that figure, um, I said I, I want to do a He-Man um, custom with this with this figure here. I think he looks pretty awesome. He comes with a lot of weapons, as you can see. He has um, Jitsu uh, chopping hand there. And um, yeah, guys, so there he has his, his uh, shield for his face, to protect his face. And um, I think he came all right. I just wanted to share this with you guys and see what you guys think. Yeah, I know he has a lot going on. He looks really busy, <laughs> but he's a warrior and um, I think he came out pretty good. Just put him with, uh, just to compare him with um, other um, He-Mans with Battle Cat. And um, just to see how, how he looks with our traditional um, He-Man. Our Snake Armor He-Man anyway. Here we have Snake Armor He-Man. I know the um, Battle Cat's not complete, but he still looks really, really good. It's really hard to get these uh, Battle Cats in good shape with all the accessories, but um, they still look good. This one's complete. This one in the middle here. So, I love the, the Snake Armor He-Man. I love that yellow hair on him. I really, really do. I really like it better than the, uh, than the uh, darker hair. So as you can see, this guy shares um, the crest of this guy. Um, Snake Armor He-Man has it on his on his chest, and this guy has it on his hammer there. And um, we're gonna bring our regular He-Man, our traditional He-Man, with his battle cat. Let's see if we can put him in here without moving the camera so much. There we go. <laughs> All right, here we go. So there's our traditional He-Man. As you can see, the crest on his chest, this guy has it on his arm. Let me show you one more time. There's He-Man's crest. And there it is right there on his arm. Uh, just to make sure that you guys know who he is. <laughs> well, yeah, I think he looks really, really good. I like the, the, the fresh colors that he has. What do you guys think? So 
But yeah, guys, um, it takes a little while to make a, a, a custom, but if you're patient enough, it comes out really, really good. And and um, I think this one came out pretty nice. And like I said, guys, just wanted to share this with you guys. So this guy consists of the armor of a palace guard and the body of Casey Jones and a head scope and a He-Man head scope, of course, and little pieces of uh, armor from other armors to do his armor <laughs> and to put a little crest there for the 2000X He-Man there in his, in his hammer. So yeah guys, takes takes quite a bit of figures to to do a custom but at the end of the day it looks really really good. Alright, so we're going to check them out a little bit and turn them around so you guys could really check them out. Alright guys, I hope you enjoyed this little custom. Like I say, I'm Little Powerhouse 102 and I'm out.